So I'd like to ask you a question related to that, you know, before a pan India Hindi release, you're already a superstar in, in the northern region and across the country, across the world. What do you have to say on that? Because a lot of Hindi speaking people, you know, they look up to you, you are their icon star, so. It's absolutely fortunate to be loved in another language because I did not speak that language, uh, nor did I cater, you know, for that particular language in particular. We were making a Telugu film and it so happened that that film got dubbed in Hindi and it was received with amazing love. And as we keep growing now, now that so many people are watching it, we want to give you the best quality film possible. Right. You know, people are showing so much love from all over, you know, from the north, from above, from other places, even, you know, small trickles from overseas. For everybody who's been showing so much love for so many years. Bye or bye, no. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Itne pyar diya hai sub love. Thank you. Maybe. Thank you. <laughs> Language has no barrier, barrier when it comes to entertainment. Jaisa Manish Shah sahab se bhi baat ho rahi thi hamari. So yes, uh, over to you, sir. Aa jaiye. Uh, your center. Rahul, I'll come to you. Ek sir. I'll come to you. Alu. Alu Please. Arjun, uh, Alu Arjun, sir, Alu Arjun Garu, Maas Garu, Sarai Nehru, Sanav Satyamurthy, July, Rez Guram, and now Pushpa. So too good. Uh, welcome everybody to Thank you. Mumbai. Uh, sir, I would like to start with you, first of all. Uh, it, this is coming uh, probably, not probably, definitely the biggest Telugu film of the year and your biggest film till now probably. It is coming one day after Spider-Man uh, No Way Home, which is also at insane levels of booking. So what is your take on the competition? What is your take on the uh, box office clash? What do you feel about that? We would like your thoughts. You know, the box office part, I'll ask Manish ji to answer that and then I'll answer it. <laughs> yeah, both of you. <laughs> okay. Content has no language. And we have proved time and again that Hindi South movies have worked. This is the biggest South movie which is coming along. And I'm damn confident it will do wonders at box office. I put on, now pass on the mic to Alusha. Alu Arjun, sir, your take. Sir, I think uh, we should be very graceful. You know, every the Hindi audience have been very graceful to South cinema. That's why South cinema could penetrate. Uh, as a South, I'm saying that, you know, we're very gracefully, you know, inviting Hindi cinema to come into the North. Same way, I think we should be very graceful in inviting over English films over to a country. And that's when they will also be very gracefully opening up you know, our language is to open in their country. So I think we should have a mutual respect for each other in each other's languages. And, and in films, I don't think language is a barrier. And we're in a situation right now, today in India, that we, India or the world over, that entire cinema, the culture of people coming to cinema has stopped. I'm not looking at one Pushpa or another one film. I'm looking at it as Indian cinema, and cinema should win. Not just Indian cinema, world cinema, overall, the culture of people coming to the theatres has gone down. I think Spider-Man should get people back into the theatres. I think Pushpa should get Indian people back into the theatres. It's about, you know, celebrating cinema back again. So I think collectively we should... I think collectively we should support each other, and I support them, and I wish them all the best for tomorrow. So one more. Uh, sorry, I forgot to introduce myself. And also, the next week, there are other big films coming in uh, Mumbai. You know, for 83, we have Mr. Ranveer Singh's and Kabir Khan sir's film that's releasing. I wish them all the best. I hope you get people back into the theatres. And uh, now that I'm a Hindi media, I'd like to once again congratulate Surya Vamshi for being a big, Ooh. big, big success and getting people back into the theatres. We are... I, I am more bothered about cinema right now than just Pushpa alone by itself. Yeah. Thank you. Very well said, sir. Uh, sir, uh, it's your word, like... And how much money he does, I think you should ask Manish, sir. <laughs> <laughs> that, will, uh, that is no doubt. Uh, sir, you've always been, you've always been a pan-India star. Uh, there is no doubt about that. By the way, Really? Yes. I've never done a Hindi film also. But that's, that's, that's your aura. Without doing a Hindi film, you've already been a pan-India star. <laughs> but uh, now, in theatrically, this is the first time uh, in spite of your movies working so well on satellite, working so well online, theatrically, this is the first time your pan-India film coming. So henceforth, like you have Icon releasing, uh, there is Icon and there's probably a Koratala Seva movie also. Henceforth, is every Alu Arjun movie going to be a pan-India film? I mean, there is no uh, doubt about it, there is no option? 
Preferably, I would like to make it everything pan India because not just about pan India. I'm saying, why are you even restricting to that? You know, maybe somebody else wants to watch it. Somebody, you know, people in other countries, maybe Sri Lanka, neighboring countries, Pakistan, other countries want to watch it. We don't know. You know, language is no barrier for uh, uh, cinema. So I think we should just go for. I would say more than pan India. I would say we should go for a multi-language release and see how far we can go as Indian cinema. Thank, Thank you, sir. Uh, your center. Uh, Rashmika, Alu Arjun sir, you both have a question. My name is Rahul here from The Filmy Church, your center. The title is very promising, the trailer is also very promising. All the best for you guys, for movies. And the title, Pushpa Naam Sun, one thing comes to mind, that iconic dialogue of Rajesh Khanna sir, Pushpa I hate tears, you can see your eyes in your eyes. So, are you both both Hindi movies lovers? Are you both watching Hindi movies as an audience? Are you both watching Hindi movies? Are you both watching Hindi movies? Yeah, yeah. I used to watch so many Hindi films. What are you saying? What kind of movies do you like to watch? Did you watch Rajesh Kana movies? As in, we used to... I was an audience. Before entering into the industry, I'm going to the theatre, watching the happening films, coming back. And also, I was in the hostel. So, for us, the movies, not of our choice, but of our school, our choices were played. So, we had no other options but to watch the films that they played. But yes, now that I'm in the industry, I think I'm watching a lot more films, a lot more techni uh, technically and a lot more personally. But uh, yeah, could say balanced, managed watching enough films. <laughs> so from childhood, we always watch a lot of, uh, of obviously because I'm multicultural, multi-language, uh, multicultural person from the South. I was born in uh, Tamil Nadu, raised in uh, Hyderabad, uh, born and raised in Chennai, and then, uh, you know, moved to Hyderabad. So I know Tamil, Telugu. We grew up watching Tamil, Telugu, Malayalam, Kannada films. And as we entered into films, we also started watching Maratha films, Bengali films, Hindi cinema. You know, Hindi cinema has definitely played a huge impact on us. Like, time and again, just like how you always watch movies, even we grew up watching all these movies. So it's a part of our life. And, uh, of course, we watch Hindi, all movies. Of course, Hindi cinema. And I personally adore Hindi cinema a lot. Alu Ji, now you have said that you welcome the South in Bollywood. So, which actor and which movie is in Bollywood that you want to make a remake and you want to work in it? Forgive me, I'll talk in Hindi. My Hindi is not good. No, I'll try to do it again. I don't know if I'm going to do it again. पता है कि मेरा हिंदी में एक्सेंट है साउथ एक्सेंट है फिर भी मैं कोशिश करके आपको हिंदी में ही बात करूंगा मैडम जी सब सब एक्टर्स आ सकते हैं इतने टैलेंटेड एक्टर्स हैं हिंदी सिनेमा में यू नो द होल ऑफ नेशनल सिनेमा में सब लोग आ सकते हैं उस उस पिक्चर्स लेके साउथ में आके प्रमोट करके डब करके सब एक्टर्स दे ऑल डू फेनोमिनल each each genre में बहुत अच्छे pictures करते हैं सब लोग हम सबको स्वागत करते हैं नहीं आप personally अगर आपको करना हो तो आप कौन से actor की और कौन सी Bollywood की film का remake करना चाहेंगे remake you personally मैं अब तक remake नहीं किया मैडम मुझे मुझे डर लगता है कि मुझे डर लगता है थोड़ा remake करने में अब तक नहीं किया मैं नहीं बोल रहा हूँ कि मैं नहीं करूँगा अब तक नहीं किया और मुझे थोड़ा डर भी है, यू नो करने के लिए इसलिए मैं थोड़ा रीमेक्स के से थोड़ा दूर कर रहता हूँ। अरु अर्जुन जी मेरा नाम आरती सक्सेन है। मैं भी हिंदी में ही पूछूँगी कि मतलब मैंने ऐसे पूछा कि अलू अर्जुन अलू अर्जुन एक्टर साउथ के एक्टर हैं तो मुझे किसी ने कहा कि वो साउथ के सलमान � so I wanted to know how much you like Salman Khan and which actor is in Bollywood that you inspire the most? Madam, I would like to inspire the most of you. Because there is a long span of career, you know, from so many years. I'll say this in English to be a little more comfortable. It's okay, yeah, yeah. I absolutely adore the megastar of the country, Amitabh Ji. Uh, I've all because we've grown up, you know, watching his films and everything. He's got a, a lot of impact on us in the growing years. So, in one word, if I have to say, I'll say I'm a huge ardent fan of Amitabh Ji. And even till date, you know, at the age, such a big age, also, I keep thinking, you know, if, even if I get really old, 
I should still be acting like how gracefully Amitabh Ji is doing it. Yes. Okay. In a way, you know, that's what I keep thinking. You know, if you're 60, 70, 80, you should still keep be as you should work as beautifully as Amitabh Ji does. Okay. And you said that you have to do the four films of this film. So what was the toughest thing in Pushpa? She'll tell which part was tough for her, and then I'll tell. Uh, no, sir, you know, the, the fights and all you guys have done. I think for us, going to the location, wo location, ya wo, uh, climate changes, or forest may uh, shoot karna pada. So I think all of that, you know, got all made all this effort. We actually had to lay a road to go to the location. It was that hard, <laughs> you know? So it was, it was crazy. And I think, like Sir said, we've done the hard work of four films in one. And I think we're going to see the results tomorrow. So I'm waiting. <laughs> uh, Madam, in a way, we are very fortunate because the top crew is always given a little extra privileges. I'd like to, you know, once again, thank the entire crew in every department, the art department, the lighting department, the production department, the drivers' unions, and they have actually given most efforts for this film. If I forgot, uh, forgive me if I've forgotten uh, if I've forgotten any other department, but every department has given their best because on shoot there are around five to six hundred people working for the film. So once again, I want to thank all the departments for putting their heart and soul and you know working more hard than us for this film. Thank you. Rashmika, this side. Hi. Hello. <laughs> You look so pretty and beautiful, Thank yet you, you portrayed uh, the character. It is a de-glam character. Yes. So did you have an, any inhibitions? Inhibitions, no. Mm. Uh, I think I had no inhibitions when it came to, I knew I was playing a different character. I knew that I had to pour my heart, soul, sweat, everything into this character because this is, like I keep saying, this is a whole different world that we're entering. and. Um, when, you know, actors like sirs doing such hard work and, you know, I'm getting this opportunity to, you know, uh, uh, work with sir. I can't have inhibitions and be like, oh my God, uh, do I look pretty? Do I look that? Do I look this? I have to worry about the performance. I'm like, am I, <laughs> am I, am I doing a good job? Am I doing that? Uh, is it coming through? Is this character staying strong? What is happening? So for me, it was all about performance in this film. And I think um, once the audience see it on the 17th, I think it'll come through. And uh, please give us your reviews. <laughs> Alu Arjun. And uh, ma'am, uh, to second that, I'd like to speak about how Rashmika performed and what is it. I truly uh, appreciate uh, Rashmika Ji for you know, performing like this and taking up such a challenging role. It is a little rustic role. And it's not a very conventional, glamorous role. It is quite challenging, and like you said, I was fearing if would she feel that she's not looking good because that is a very huge factor that plays on the mind. And if your mind is not clear, your performance will not be clear. But then after she landed on the set and she worked, she started working. I think she had the mindset that this film is this, and we have to justify this film. And she did a wonderful performance, and I couldn't have performed if not for hell, her help, because every artist should compliment you for your performance. She performed so well, it was very, very comforting, and it was very complimenting to work with such a wonderful artist. Tomorrow, I'm sure you all will appreciate her performance. She can't speak for herself, but I can definitely speak for her, because I've seen her perform in front of my eyes. Thank and you. the song that we uh, just witnessed, you know. <laughs> So, uh, really, you know, do sir, I? Yeah, of course. Little? And I was just going to ask you. <laughs> I was after that. I'll ask you. I mean, you look so handsome and uh, uh, good hunk. Why thing. don't you? Why don't you do a romantic role also? <laughs> uh -huh. My previous film was a romantic role. <laughs> okay, coming back to the song, I was asked uh, uh, the gestures that you did. You know, reminded me of so much of Rajni sir that. Small, small nuances. So, will there be a comparison with the, the Thalaiva? Ma'am, more than comparison, I'll say it's more of an influence because I was born, brought up from Chennai. So, obviously, I have a lot of subconscious absorption from big superstars like uh, Rajni sir, like Kamal sir. You know, that's why if you see I'm very perform. Like if you notice that, then I, you know, then I came to Hyderabad. Mr. Chirinjigaru is my own uncle. 
you know, when I see him, he does, he dances really well, and there are the, his nuances. So I think, you know, subconsciously, when you work as a child, when you uh, grow up seeing these people, you absorb them, and they're there subconsciously in your mind. Not that I very consciously wants to do it. If it came across like that, also, I don't have an issue. And I think it's maybe a you can say maybe it's a tribute for them, <laughs> in a way. My respects for them, in a way. <laughs> Recently, the uh, Telugu government has, you know, introduced about the tickets. So, will that affect uh, big films? Nonetheless, it will be very good for the audiences, you know. They'll get to see um, No, ma'am. Everything has been sorted. Nothing of that sort. Okay. No, everything is going in a positive way all over. You know, cinemas, people have been coming back to the theatres. Movies have been coming out. Every language has been opening up. Uh, maybe except for Kerala, there's 100% occupancies in every place and there are multiple. And the government is also supporting the films. And I'd like to thank all the governments from all over the country for supporting Indian cinema. Thank you so much. <laughs> Lastly, your question, uh, you also produce, turned producer. So, uh, are you producing independently or will you be producing with Ma'am, I'm dad? a son of a producer. So, I came in as a, I was born producer, dad. then turned with, actor. <laughs> with, with dad, I mean. My father is a producer. So, it's, I'm a producer. <laughs> I'm a born producer turned actor, maybe. <laughs> uh, hi, Alu sir, over here. Himesh, this side. Hello. Firstly, congratulations. The film looks very interesting. Right, it's releasing tomorrow. Say all the best. And all the best, of course. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thank you, my brother. Thank uh, you. I have two questions for you. First sure. one, if I'm not wrong, Pushwa was initially conceptualized as a one-part film. And then through the shoot, you decided on making a second part as well. Could you tell us something on the idea of spinning it into two parts and what's the status on second part at the moment? Absolutely. I'd like to also Devi to speak two words about it, then also I'll speak. Okay. <laughs> okay. See, the, the story of this film, Pushpa, uh, when Sukubai, Sukusar narrated to us, it was it's a very intense one. And there are a lot of uh, interesting elements and a lot of uh, you know, detailed... Uh, writing that went into this film. So when Suku sir narrated itself, I was thinking, how are they going to accommodate the whole of this into one film? Was one thing that we all thought because everything was interesting. So when writing gets so interesting, then we don't feel like deleting anything, right? So then they came up with this idea of two parts, and then I was the first one because even before it was announced, Suku sir called and said, "Devi, we're going to do like this." And I was the one who jumped like up with joy and said, "Okay, now you're doing justice to this film because every scene that these guys uh, conceived was so interesting." So I think this film deserves uh, to be released in two parts, and you will all love it in two parts. So when uh, Sukumar sir told me the film, when he narrated itself, I felt it is like a four-hour film. I said, "How will we make this four-hour film into a three-hour film?" He said, let's just somehow compress it <laughs> in the process. <laughs> and when we started shooting the film, it started decompressing even more. <laughs> it started getting longer. And the time, when, by the time we cut the first half itself, it's, it's a very huge film. So it was very clear, you know, in the process of making the film itself, the film is very clearly telling you, boss, I cannot be made in one part. You know, it's asking for two. So generally, we always listen to the film. You know, the content always tells you something. You should just be open to listen to it. So it, it, it was saying that it needs two parts, and I think we respected that. And what's the status of the second part uh, as we speak? Uh, Ray, tomorrow <laughs> part one is releasing, <laughs> and then part two. Na? Let's save it for a surprise, because I think I'll be ans uh, I'll be, it'll be even more interesting to answer that question tomorrow, once the film is out, and how the part one ends, right? Yeah. You know, as a, as a prelude to that, then I can speak. Okay. Uh, and Alusa, you are, you know, you are a fantastic actor and that aside, one, another factor which has got you that pan-India recognition is your dancing. All your songs are huge hits on YouTube, even in indie belts. Thank you. Can we expect you, like, are you looking to do a pan-India dance-based film with, you know, worlds of Bollywood, one Bollywood act dance actor and dancer coming together with you? That, that is one genre which everyone would want to see. Uh, and with whom? <laughs> uh, honestly, um, Dance, genre, film, I don't know. I've never thought about it, to be very honest. I've never thought about it. I genuinely think, uh, in my opinion, this is just my opinion, um, I think dance is more enjoyed when it's a part of the film than it being the whole emotion of the film. For me, because cinema is about emotion. Dance is just a part of entertainment. In certain films, like you said, dance film, you know, dance becomes a part of, is the main part of the emotion. But for me, I personally like cinema, the emotion of a cinema, and then small pieces of dance in, in it. So that's my take. <laughs> um, on doing a whole uh, dance film, I 
personally think I'm not very much for it somewhere. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, sir, and best of luck for the release. Thank you. I need a lot of luck. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, hi, sir. Um, so, uh, before I begin, actually, it might be a long question. Um, you just said that uh, today we are looking for acceptance of different kinds of movies. Um, you know, there was a point when if you Google your name, it would say, any of your names, it would say, Rashmika Mandana is a South Indian film actor, Lu Arjun is a South Indian film actor. Today, uh, Wikipedia says uh, Allu Arjun is an Indian actor who primarily works in a particular industry, or Rashmika Mandana is an Indian actress who primarily works. I think there is an uh, insane amount of respect and um, um, appreciation for all kinds of films. Um, I have seen that, you know, from the time I have been here, I've seen that uh, we have welcomed uh, all kinds of movies. And I'm not saying about us, I'm talking about the Indian audience. Um, while I speak to you, there's a friend uh, who's an RJ in Punjab who told me that, listen, please tell them that we are excited to watch the movie. I have a nine-year-old niece uh, who told me when Sitima released that, uh, you know, it's Allu versus Sallu. I said, how did you know? <laughs> so these are things, when you say that you, am I really, uh, people do, re do really people love me that much? There is an instant amount of love maybe which you will get to see with this film. Um, I want to know, do you see the changing shifts? in the industries and the respect that is given to each other? Let her speak, then I'll speak. Ah, yeah, both of you. I think there is an extreme, uh, as in in the last decade, I think we've seen such a shift in our cinema, in our field. Um, I've just entered the industry in four years, but I've seen so much happening before I entered, and when I'm a part of Indian cinema now, and I can't be proud of it, I couldn't have entered a better time. You know, I think this is the perfect time that I'm in the industry because I see, uh, like you said, the languages are, uh, you know, merging together. We're having pan-India releases. It's going to be, like Sir said, Indian films rather than South India film or, you know, a Bollywood film. It's not going to do that anymore. In a couple of years, I think it's just going to be Indian cinema. Yeah. You know, probably we're going to glo go globally you know, dubbing our film in their languages. So we just need to see the reach. I think we should always experiment with that. But uh, I think it's fa fascinating and it's super, uh, it's amazing to see all, people just appreciate content now. People just want good content. Um, you know, people want good filmmaking and when you give it, people appreciate it and they make it their own. Absolutely. It's a very interesting... What's your name? Sorry? Nayandeep. Nayandeep. How old are you? I'm 29. <laughs> You're very mature for your age. <laughs> I appreciate it. Um, it's a very wonderful question that you asked, by the way. You should see cinema, how it's running, how the trends have been running in the last 10 years, like I'm seeing in the 2000s. You know, it's a very clear back between the South cinema and North cinema. You know, let's be honest about it. Uh, and then if you see the entire 2010s, you know, the... The bridges, you know, there have been beautiful bridges, thanks to people like Manish Ji, <laughs> you know, who have uh, bridged those gaps. Uh, and now everybody's getting familiar with each other's cinema. And I'm telling you, from the next decade onwards, from the 2020s, the lines will be so blurry that it will not matter where it comes from. It is only the content that will matter. They'll not be South actors, North actors. It'll all be about Indian cinema growing. And I'm telling you, with wonderful platforms that have opened, like OTTs, there's so many set of new filmmakers, directors, actors, technicians. You know, this has opened up amazing horizons for us in the entertainment industry. And we as Indian entertainment industry, not just cinema, we as Indian entertainment industry are going to be the, a very huge or probably one of, probably the biggest players in, in the next decade. And I'm very positive as a country we will go up. Absolutely. Thank Absolutely. you. Rashmika, we'll uh, one last question. Yeah. I also had one question for yeah, Rashmika. I'll come. Small I'll come. one. Sorry. Yeah, I'll come. Um, so, Rashmika, you know your movies, Hindi movies are also releasing. And there is a pan India approach to all the films that you've done, whether it's a Geeta Govindam also and Dear Comrade, uh, which people have watched. Um, how do you see, uh, you know, I have met uh, people who are from South, and um, now that we are meeting quite often, um, there's a sense of, warmth, you know, and there's a sense of imagery on screen. And it's very different, you know. How do you see those two worlds mixing when, when you do films like these? 
As in, I think um, for us, for me, I, I can speak only for myself, and for me, as much of fame and the glamour there is out there, for me, it's me doing good work and good content and me doing the best I can in a, a firm that I'm a part of. You know, uh, me playing Shrivali, I can't believe that I did some character like this, you know, and it's so special. And I think this film is my career's biggest film. And I've done what the best I could do in this film. So for me, when I choose characters, yeah, when I work in a different industry, I'm just doing the best I can at that point of time. I, I don't look at, oh my God, this is happening. Yeah, that is happening. This I'll be seen, like that I'll be seen. It's not that. For me, it's my characters, it's my game, it's my uh, play area, so I'll do, <laughs> do so. <laughs> All the best, actually. Thank you. Alisa, to your right. Uh, up to your right, Alisa. Okay. Uh, so. Thank you. How can I come on for my own <laughs> performance? <laughs> I can, he can't. <laughs> I can't comment on my performance. It'll come across very wrong. Uh, I really wish tomorrow it touches uh, more than awards. Awards is something that comes later. And I do like awards. I will not uh, lie about it. Uh, awards is a much, I'd say it's, it's stage two. What a sta where I'm at stage one. We're going to enter stage one where people are going to watch the movie. People have to like it, and I'm expecting, I know I'm very curious about how people are going to receive this film in different languages and different audiences and different places of the country. Um, I really genuinely wish they all like our performances. Uh, we all have, I've tried to do something new when it comes to performance. We, you know, this movie is also about uh, focus on a lot of uh, performances. I hope tomorrow people appreciate that, and that is the first part. And, and if people like it, and, and, and everybody likes it, and if I'm blessed, and I'll be so, so grateful. <laughs> Hello, can I, can I say something because you brought this topic up? Mm. Because I always believe uh, in the vibes that people spread, you know. Uh, when people love people, when people try to give love to people, that's how the love spreads. See, this is something that I said four days back in Chennai, but you're referring to that after four days in Mumbai. That means it's crossed <laughs> states and boundaries. And that's why we always, what we can do, the best thing that humans can do is just spread love and just wish good for others. Because the vibes do come true. Because not just as a friend, because after I saw the work that Sukumar sir and Bunny has done, I'm sorry, Allah Arjun, I, we call him Bunny, Allah Arjun has done, it's my pure love for them and feeling that they deserve that, you know. But I said it with such a pure feeling and pure heart, that's why it reached you. So if you all also wish with the same uh, pure kind of love for our film, it's going to be one of the biggest blockbusters in India and maybe all these things will come true. Love is what matters, that's it. Devi, Thank you. Devi Alu, sir, to your right, uh, uh, Arjun. Out, uh, Alu, uh, uh, I just want to ask you one question. Both of you have made your name as far as Telugu is concerned and in the dubbed versions also in Hindi. Why don't you take up the step of acting in an original Hindi film and you composing for a Hindi film? And the second question is, Mr. Arvind, has he not come here earlier? He used to come quite often to Bombay and I used to meet him. <laughs> Uh, sir, Arvind Garu has been busy producing Bollywood films and he's not, you know, I think I should call him and tell him, you know, start making a film with your son also. He's also a reasonable actor. <laughs> 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 uh, good thing, sir. I'll tell Arvind Garu. Arvind Garu, there's, uh, there's your son who's also an actor in your house. Please do make films <laughs> with him. Please take him to Bollywood. Not just you simply make, uh, you know, be the first 100 crores film in Bollywood and now you're making so many multiple films in Bollywood. Please, there's also one guy in your house if you want, if you want to promote him, he's available. <laughs> and, and at the same time, Arvind uncle, what uncle? I'm also like your son only. You know me since my childhood. You are making films of all Bollywood heroes only in Bollywood. Your hero and your music director. <laughs> I am also there. She's already, there. you're already doing no. <laughs> I don't know Hindi. <laughs> 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 but, 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 but at but this Arvind point. Devi, tell Arvind that his friend Jyoti Venkatesh asked about him. Uncle, your friend Jyoti Venkatesh here is very angry because you are not putting <laughs> us in Bollywood films. <laughs> he misses you a lot, Uncle. But on this note, I would also, uh, with love, say, say that we are. Do I am doing uh, music for a couple of films, including Rohit Shetty Sir's uh, Circus with uh, Ranveer uh, and all that. So I wish you give me the same kind of love. So wish me luck so that I do more of Bollywood. <laughs> I wish I could also give a news like this, but I don't have anything like that. No, that's that's totally his. 
decision, so he can give it any time he wants. <laughs> and the grand finale question from there. Uh, but, uh, but, uh, on a serious note, sir, out here, on your right, sir, up on your right. Family. So, uh, did it help you in becoming a superstar so fast? Because Chiranjeevi is your uncle. And uh, would you like to work with him in any film? You belong to a family uh, of celeb Absolutely, celeb sir. I cannot, with all humility, you know, I cannot say that, you know, I'm a very self-made actor. I have come from a film background and that definitely helped me to be whoever I am. How much part of it, you know, really helped and how much was my own can never be quantified. You know, it's something that we can never quantify. That debate can go on forever. But I'm grateful for the great, uh, for the background support that they've given. Thank you. Bas, Ajo. Uh, but uh, uh, you know, on a, on a, you know, in one of your earlier interviews, you had mentioned uh, that you know uh, Hindi film in your filmography is very important. Uh, Sorry, can you be a little loud? Uh, you had mentioned earlier that a Hindi film in your filmography is very important for you. Uh, have has there been offers that you have considered, or probably now, like you said, you know, the lines are blurring. Do you want to do a pure Bollywood film? Uh, Absolutely, um, I love Hindi cinema. Uh, you know, somehow I sometimes I even I use the word, but I don't like to use that word Bollywood as much as possible because you know it sounds like second to Hollywood. And ham kisi se kam nahi, ham kisi se kam nahi. So I like to say it Hindi cinema. <laughs> so, so even by habit, you know, sometimes even I say Bollywood, but I keep going. I was like, no, say Hindi cinema. Ham kisi se kam nahi. Coming back to your question, I I love Hindi cinema. I love Hindi music. I appreciate them so much. Like, I um, definitely it'd be a great uh, moment in my life to do a straight Hindi film, and uh, it'll be a very it'll be a landmark point of my career. And I want to make it. I want to make the best choice possible. And uh, to just answer what you said, uh, there have been people who ask for films here and there, but nothing very um, excited. Uh, nothing very exciting. So I think. Slowly, you know, we're being having soft talks. Like, if we can do something, how is it to mount up something big? Because even the people who are coming, they are also saying that when we have to come to you, we have to come with something solid. So I think once everything falls into place, I think we, I will try to plan uh, with maybe little help of Alwar and Garu if he helps. <laughs> Just a joking. Um, I think we'll try to come up with something big and you know make it memorable. Thank you. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, for that wonderful interaction. And now, Jate Jate, Alusa, is there something that you'd like to... Yes, and uh, before I leave, I'd like to thank everybody who's been a part of this film. I'd like to thank my director, Sukumar Garu, who's introduced me. Two minutes. <laughs> I'm not getting up. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank my director, Sukumar Garu, for making this wonderful movie with me, Pushpa. I mean, I've, uh, my career has taken off with the movie called Arya. And we made Arya 2, which got me a lot of recognition from all over. And now it's our third film. And I hope we hit a big, big, big hat trick with this Pushpa, which is coming on December 17th. And in my career, in my life, music plays a very huge part. And that whole music, I think I give the biggest credit to my director, music director, Sri Devishit Prasad, who's been the biggest music director in South India. Today he's playing Pushpa. You know, he's being given, uh, sorry, he's given amazing music to Pushpa. Thank you so much, my dear Devi, darling. All my life, you have been, all my career life, you've been playing amazing music. You've given me chart busters today, you know. And Manish says, uh, Manish sir says, you know, you've given, you know, hundreds of people have received your music. There's so many millions of views on YouTube and stuff like that. A lot of big, big, big credit goes to you. Thank all you so love much. To you, and all take me love. more into the people with your music. Take me more <laughs> into the people's hearts with your music. Actually, thank you for all the love and trust. <laughs> Always love Thank you. you. <laughs> thank you. No, no, I'm not done yet. No, no, I'm not done. No, I'll give, I'll give, I'll give, I'll give, I'll give. Ista, ista. One minute. I'm not done yet. Yeah, I'm not done yet. One second, darling. I'm sorry. One second. <laughs> uh, and I'd like to thank my producers, my three pictures, and Mutam City Media for producing this movie with me. And I'd like to thank Manish Ji from Goldmines Films for not just about uh, releasing Pushpa, but for, you know, I think he's one of the pioneers in getting uh, dubbing South movies into the North and making all South India. I'd like to behalf on not just Pushpa or me, on behalf of all the South Indians for making us so popular all over the country. Thank you very much, Manish Ji. Thank you for taking us into the heartland of uh, North India. Thank you so we much. Thank you for giving such good movies to us. And oh, to people thank you. From and the also India the heartland. thank you, thank you. And also, I'd like to thank uh, Anil Ji for you know distributing this movie. And if I forget anybody else, please forgive me. And above all, 
Thank you so much, my dear Rashmika. It was a pleasure working with you. You know, you know, everybody calls her national crush. <laughs> you know, I've heard of people who are calling her national crush. So I simply cutely tease her on stage. I was like, oh, please come, Rashmika. <laughs> national crush. Plus Rashmika. Thank you so much. And I hope you all like, and we all, I'm hoping that we touch your hearts with Pushpa. Come, we're coming tomorrow, December 17th. Pushpa, Pushparaj. Oh, what the <laughs> <girl. laughs> Thank, you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so, Thank you so much, much for being so amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Pushpa. Okay, and now it's time for a quick photo op. Quick photo op, yes. I, I, I promised him one last question. Thank you. Mumbai lo, are Mumbai lo tum Telugu kya baat kyun barkat kar rahe ho? Hindi baat karo bhai. Bol. Hindi ra nyak ne ne mar lata na. Yeah, tell me. Easiest thing in this movie is Tagge <laughs> Dele. Thank you. Thank we you are running uh, you. short of time, ladies and gentlemen. So we have to rush. Thank you so much for being so cool. Zordar Talia, come on.